guys, it's Mallory from Trendy Vintage Classic and welcome back to my YouTube channel where I teach about selling clothing on eBay for money. Um, those of you who watched my last video, this was something I thrifted. It was pretty little things and I noted that I'm pretty sure I saw Khloe Kardashian wearing it because she is a sponsor of Pretty Little Things. So this is my thrifted item today that I am wearing and I'm keeping. These are my high school colors, red and black. So let's get right into it. Today's video is going to be all about what's sold. It's gonna be a pretty quick video. Um, I have Manny in the background. Say hi, Manny. Hi, um, That's my dress. So the first thing that I wanna mention is that I did run a sale of 20% off, um, being that I wanted to get last year's inventory cleared out because I have a lot of new inventory that I'm excited to put up and I'm not one of those huge stores which has lots of listings that they can list. So I do wanna just clear out my inventory and get some new stuff up there, get ready for spring and summer. Um, I feel that'll be really exciting. We're all looking forward to warmer times, better times. Well, those of us who are going through winter right now. So the first thing that um, I'm going to talk about that I sold was a robe. Robes are selling really well on eBay right now. Um, it is the winter time in a lot of parts of the US. It was from Laura Ashley. It was a large, extra large, plush black robe, new without tags, and that sold for $24.90. It'll be up there. Um, and all, my buyers always pay shipping, so that doesn't cut into my cost. The next item I'm going to talk about is I sold a monster HDMI cord, um, and I pay, and the buyer paid $21.99 plus $7.50 shipping. And basically, I got this from Walmart. Now, if this is something you guys don't know about, um, it's something that I think would be really important to do. You can download the Walmart app and scroll down to the price scanner and go to the clearance section and scan items that are already on clearance or rollback and you can see if they come up with a secret clearance price. So this, this one specific HDMI cord was um, marked at $40 and when I scanned it, it said $5. So that was the only one there or I would have bought a bunch. But um, I bought it for five, flipped it for 22. So not bad. I was hoping to get a little more, but um, it was kind of a lot up there. So not bad though. Uh, my next item is a Blair, which is kind of an older brand, women's extra large, tapestry vintage jacket um now i remember like my mom and my aunts wearing this type of jacket that's why i was so drawn to it when i saw it i did buy it at the bin so i probably paid only a dollar something for it it's it is a christmas type of print but it's also nautical it has um like a lighthouse in it and so i did pick it up because it reminded me of my childhood it was kind of nostalgic and there, there are customers out there that want these specific type of tapestry prints. So the buyer paid $22.05 um, plus shipping. So that was a good flip considering I only paid a dollar something for it. And I dropped the price because it did sell after Christmas. So I didn't want to hang on to it until next winter or I probably would have gotten more money for it. So the next item is Ralph Lauren. We all know Ralph Lauren. Um, this was a hunter green button up, but it was a small. Um, so smaller sizes are harder to sell. So someone sent me an offer. I think I had it up for over $20 and someone sent me an offer for 15. And I accepted it because it is more of a holiday color, more of a winter color. And like I said, I'm just clearing out my inventory. And this was something I also only paid a dollar for. So it was still a flip. My next item are those Miss Me jeans. If you saw in my Goodwill Bins haul, I got these for about 73 cents. 
new lip tags. They retail at $100 and they're known for their bedazzled back um, pockets. They usually have like crosses on them and they're bedazzled. And I, they were a size 33, which is a bigger size, which is great. And they sold for $55 plus shipping. So that was like pure profit right there. That was probably my best sale um, of the month actually. Um, next was Woolrich. Um, that is a brand to always look out for if you see it because it is made very well. It's wool and um, it did sell for $19.15 plus shipping and that is only because of the sale I was running. It would have sold for more but like I said I was I'm trying to get rid of my winter inventory and it was gray with kind of that um, arctic pattern on it so it is more of a winter style. Um, next another one I'm excited about were these Spanx. Now Spanx do sell extremely well and so I told you guys that I went to my local Lord & Taylor, which was having a liquidation sale because they're closing. Closing, So I picked these up for around three or $4. And when I looked up comps, since they were the high, high-waisted body shapers, anything high-waisted nowadays we know is on trend, but these were high-waisted body shapers and I sold them for $35 plus shipping and I only paid $50 for them. And that's just tights, that's not even a pair of pants. So pick up Spanx when you see them at a good price. Next is a moth by, that's an anthropology brand. And it's just, it was just a hunter green sweater. Um, it was cable knit. And I did accept an offer of $13 because like I said, I wanna clear up my, my winter inventory. So the buyer also paid almost $7 shipping. So I only paid a couple dollars for it. So that was okay. Um, the next item I actually um, posted last night and it sold overnight. Um, which surprised me. So we don't always have to go after those bolo brands. Um, there are just people out there that want their favorite brand. And we have um, older women, older men that are shopping on eBay also um, that aren't always looking for the on-trend stuff. So I believe in having stuff on my eBay site for everyone. So this um, was, an extra large size 18 swimming cover up top. It had ruched sides with like a string and it had this nice orange and blue type of look to it. And it almost reminded me of something my mother would wear. Um, but it sold overnight. Um, they only paid $18.90 plus shipping. Once again, that was with the 20% off sale that I'm running. And my last item, I was kind of sad to see it go because I kind of love Cherished Teddies by Inesco. There are, if you look up an eBay under comps for Cherished Teddies and you sort from highest, you will be amazed at how much some of them sell for. Most of them, I will say, aren't worth anything. But I have been grateful enough to find ones that were. I found a couple rare Halloween ones at a tag sale. Um, and both of them sold for, one was signed and sold for about 140, I wanna say, and I paid $3 for it. And the other one sold for about 40, and I paid $3 for it. So there, are, a lot of the Halloween ones sell really well and Harvest, I'm not sure why. But this one um, is called Gret or Grete. Um, and it's really cute, you'll see it up above. It's a little sled and with like a baby. And so it's, it's a snow winter type of item, not necessarily Christmas. Um, but this was one of the ones I did look up comps and they were going for about 30. I tried to list it a little lower than that. And then with the discount, they ended up paying $19.99 plus shipping. So that's okay with me. My mindset is looking forward to springtime and summertime. Um, so that's all I have for today. Thank you for watching. Please share, please share with someone who can benefit from this. Anyone can sell anything in their house. You don't have to go out and source items. You can just sell clothes you're done with. 
there is something for everyone out there on eBay. It's international, you have all ages, all types of people looking for even just basic brands. So go out there and make some extra cash. And also you can follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Trendy Vintage Classic and my link is in the description for my eBay store. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.